the TAS system is a new system. It's a new way of taking information, data, feeds from existing airport systems and bringing them all into one place. A fresh way of analysing security information is being developed with the help of Heathrow Airport. Known as TAS, it brings together different sources of data and offers security experts a single interface to see what's happening on the ground. So what we see here is the uh, MMI, uh, main machine interface of uh, the system. The idea is that all the information that is being analysed is going to be displayed here. The airport operator programs the system to make connections between data sources and highlight potential threats in real time. So if there is an emerging threat, the alert will be shown here in real time. So for example, you see here the different alerts. Uh, each color represents different risk level. Red is a high risk level of the alert. And uh, other screens uh, can show different information uh, of the system. For example, there is a 3D visualization. Uh, all the terminal, indoor and outdoor, is being modeled by uh, uh, one of our technological uh, partners. For security reasons, baggage left unattended will be removed and destroyed. The TAS test sensors at Heathrow monitor everything from cargo to car parks. We have also all the location of uh, different vehicles, even the location of passengers, I mean anonymously, but uh, we can see the flow of passengers inside the, inside the terminal, even may see a uh, location of uh, airplanes. The system, conceived in an EU research project, is designed to complement existing airport security systems already in place. Any big airport could benefit from a system like this. It could deliver information to a single user. It could have the opportunity to bring synergies across lots of systems and also potentially reduce manpower by decreasing the amount of resource that's required to operate and monitor these systems on an ongoing basis.